Hello, I'm Stella. Hello, I'm Emily. And we both work at St Francis Hospice with children and families. Today we're going to make a protection shield. This shield can help children when they have worries and anxieties and it's a form of helping them feel protected. And you can have any size um, shield you want, so it could be really little and you can put it in your pocket and carry it around with you, or you can have a larger one. Um, so first of all, I made this one out of a cardboard box, so you can use anything, paper or card. And the use, if you can find in the kitchen, is some foil, and then you can wrap up the cardboard to start making your shield. You can also use paints or felt paints if you haven't got any foil. And once you've done that, you could use ribbon like I have here, or you could use a marker and make a cross in there. And these sections are going to have your strengths in, or your support network. Another idea we had is maybe you can do some drawings and cut out who do you think protects you. And I've put here other children. So it could be your siblings or good friends that you can feel protected with. And here's a few words. One is strength, kindness to each other, and having courage. That can also feel protective. And you can also think about where you feel calm. Um, so that might be um, in your bedroom, or it could be cuddling a dog, or it could be a holiday. So for me, I thought about a beach, um, nice calm waters in the beach. And then also family, again, you're supporting you, um, how you support each other within your family and maybe with your friends and the love that you have, which is also a strength. I hope you enjoy making this shield. Try it out because it's good fun and you can put it somewhere in your room to remember you're protected. Bye. Bye.